Hey y'all, welcome to another episode of 5 Minutes with Jodo. Right now we are in Quartzsite, Arizona. Behind us is the Great Pinewood Tree. It's supposed to be about 1,050 years old. So we're just walking around Quartzsite. We're actually driving around Quartzsite looking at the oddities. For those of you who don't know what Quartzsite is, it is a RV mecca for snowbirds. Um, so right now, January is the height of its season, so there's no discounts in any of the RV parks. But most people come to Quartzsite so they can uh, dry land. This is the dry camp. This is a very large area with dispersed camping, so either you have a permit, um, so you don't have to have any hookups or anything else. So people come down here because camping is free to about $180 if you want to stay in a place with water and um, dump station for so we're just going to be walking around. You'll see pictures coming through and out. And of course, once we get home, because it is windy, we will start and finish this video there. And we'll see you on the other side. Bye. While we were gone, I went to the grocery store. And it's the Roadrunner grocery store. It's really small, but it has a lot packed into it. You can get just about anything that you need, um, food-wise, um, band-aids, anything like that, drinks. They do have alcohol there also, both liquor and wine and beer. So if you are looking for some food items, that's a great place to go. Um, it's crowded on Fridays and Saturdays, and today is Friday, so we had to stand in line for a bit. But they are very cordial and they try to keep people, you know, happy while you're waiting in line. So, but it's a good place to go. The other place that I went was um, to ask some questions about solar. Um, even though we're not really looking to put solar on this um, RV. I do think um, we were needing an inverter of some sort um, to help us power up and charge our phones and laptops and those type of things when we do go out and we're not hooked up to power. They were very knowledgeable. They had all the equipment you can need. They even installed solar on site. And it was very, very, it was a very, very good experience. So if you are looking for solar and you're in the Quartzsite area, um, please check them out. It's Billy Solar. So Quartzsite really is a, a RVers haven. There are many places that cater to RVs. The gas stations, most of the gas stations are really nice. You can pull in and pull right out. It's, it's great. There's a place called the RV Pit Stop, which I thought was an absolutely fascinating place. You, there's a dump station. You can get propane. You can get onboard water or you can fill water jugs. All of those things come at, uh, at a, a nominal cost, but you can do it all in one location. Uh, and so and we've been out a couple of times today or driven by it a couple times today and it's had steady service all day long uh, Because of all the events happen in Quartzsite in January uh, or a lot of many different events happen in Quartzsite in January You just have to pack your patients everywhere that you go. We also went to a flea market, which was quite interesting um, We didn't buy anything, but there was lots of different items. So uh, I, there was between tools or if you needed a sailing hitch uh, I don't know why in Quartzsite we might need that but there were they were there um, golf clubs wagon wheels there were all kinds of interesting items for sale anything that you could think of it was for sale um, so we're really just rounding up really spending our last two days in Quartzsite getting up prepared so we as we go into bash um, because we're getting ready to, to leave Quartzsite and, and go to our next location where we'll be dry camping. So we hope we'll have more on that on our next episode. And uh, we hope you enjoy. Take care. Be safe.